Hello everyone, it's Open House Thursday on Your View. Welcome to the show. I am Morayo Afolabi Brown as always. Hello. Good morning. Hey guys. Morning. Happening. YK. Hello. How good are morning. you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Very well, very well. That is good, that is good, <laughs> and we're all fine. <laughs> Anything happening? As, late as usual. To oh the wow, set. YK had to put you on the spot. Oh mm -hmm. yes, I had to. All of you had a touch of blue today. Yeah, nice. Except you. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, um, top the YK, anything happening? Any gist for us? Um, yes, yeah, so I had one gist and I've forgotten it. <laughs> Can you what, imagine? While you're booting, let me come to Nima. <laughs> Nima, how are you? Gist. I'm just grateful to God for life, grateful to God for strength. Um, I'm just grateful. Okay. The details out there. Okay, I guess we're going very quickly. Topway, how are you? <laughs> I'm good. Yesterday was my cousin's wedding, um, and I almost missed it. I assumed that all weddings, traditional weddings, would be on Thursday. And so I just felt, oh, Thursday, no matter, Thursday, no matter. And I didn't call me in the morning that, I hope you're getting ready for the wedding. And it totally skipped me, but it was fine to see all my cousins. And these people I grew up with virtually were together almost um, every holiday. And they are nine children. They had two twins, two idols, and like three before them. So it's like a big family. Oh, two sets of twins. Yes, separate. she had two oh. sets of oh, the, wow. the. My aunt had two sets of twins, and you know, it's 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 really a warm family. It's large, warm. Everybody's all kiss kiss, love love. I felt really blessed being with them. It was really good. And so the the main gig will be on Saturday, and we'll turn up. Um, I'm looking okay. forward to it. Good. Like, have you booted? I haven't. I just, and it was a very serious uh, sweet gist, too. Yeah. That's I how I thought you were going just... to go with your normal people again, but you have become very That's gentle. That's the reason you know. I'm just grateful. Uh, but I saw them, they sweep because our areas. They are teaching me. And they sweep our areas they, well. Because this is where they live. Uh, They've they abandoned the areas people there. Well. That's where they get revenue. Nothing has happened so far. Nothing has happened. I see, like, five people sweeping a section, and they do, uh, this, I live on this area, and they do a good job here. <laughs> That's where they I, was I think we should set up a meeting with the... No, I'm learning, I want to learn love bedroom voice to come and talk to them. Okay, no worries. So, no, <laughs> so no, we've said the, 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 guy, you show the guy, the guy, the guy, we're trying to get the MD of Loma to, hit, to come to It's not show. only Loma. So. It's like all the agencies are sleeping. Mm, we will zone. I'm, I'm sitting in traffic because right. there's nobody regulating traffic right. and we have a traffic manager. So we'll continue to talk. See, the, what we have, the tool we have is talk about. Yes. Yes. So that's all we'll continue to do. Mm. Hopefully at and some point. And get the attention enough to generate right. an action. Right. Cool. So if I remember Thursday. my gist in the middle of the show, can I say it? <laughs> I don't know, why why can this That's past the so that, That's past. a fast. But, but know, Lagos yeah. traffic is definitely something worth talking about. People are complaining for hours to get to work <laughs> Do every we have single a news day. Mention? Yes, we have a news mention. Why can just... No. The, the, about the event of the lady that came on the show yesterday. They've forgotten to tell you about it. Oh, dear. Oh, and I, I don't have information about it. Oh, okay. I'm not aware. Mm. Well, the lady that came She's yesterday. Yes. Yeah. 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 She has an yes, event yes, coming yes. up. Oh. Yeah, they have an event, I think, for young girls. Oh. So. Um, that would be nice. She really got everybody crying yesterday. I mean, it was yeah. really. Yeah. Everybody got. About everybody. I mean, I was hoping was that somebody emotional. could at least reach out to her. Mm. Somebody could help her out. Yeah, mm. because she obviously still needs um, some mm. kind of healing. But uh, we'll definitely talk about her event at some point. A lot of people watch the show, and a lot of people actually come. Connected, on the show. Connected. And uh, my friend said, Why didn't I tell them that everybody can be a mother? Yeah. But it's not everybody that is a mother. Yeah, that's you know? so true. Okay, let's go on a break now. When we come back, we'll review the top stories in the paper. Stay with us, we'll be right back. Thanks for staying with us. We're going to start with the nation. <clears throat> Buhari's order on one trillion naira projects jolts senators and reps. Constituents demands answer. ICPC reports misleading, say lawmakers. FG releases minimum wage circular to label. And picture here some inductees. Class of 2017-2018 taking oath of induction into the medical and dental profession of the College of Medicine University of Ibadan. My prayer is that after all that work, <laughs> God be Nigeria will be able to absorb you yes. and um, yeah, and give you what you deserve because mm -hmm. well, it's good to celebrate them but at the end of the day i just pray they don't just leave the country mm -hmm. telecom firms shown minister data cut directive fec okays 500 million euro loan to create 1.2 million era jobs sorry 1.2 million jobs Osho is investment destination government's using force over payroll asu alleges um pacac that's p-a-c-a-c Backs Mago's retention by uh, President Buhari. 
Okay. So Mr. President Buhari's um, one trillion naira constituency projects for ten years allegation has started um, reactions from the House of Reps and House of Assembly. In fact, the Speaker of the House of Reps they said that it wasn't fact based. People had things to say about it. And then um, uh, former Senator Senator Sheo Sani was saying that, you know, that they were to highlight areas where they wanted their constituency project done. It's still the executive that will carry out the uh, projects in those areas where they've highlighted and that no money is exchange hands. It's not like they give them the money to execute the project. So they just they go back and forth. We'll go later and get the clear picture who go do <laughs> boho transformers for us in those areas. But we at least we know that they are, well we'll see, us, we'll see how that goes because mm -hmm. um ICPC obviously is investigating yes. and we're gonna they should see because it's wrong for the, for the discourse to tell a community that has bought transformer to sign it to them before they can connect to the grid. Mm. It's very wrong. That's that corruption that in the happens. highest form. But that's the way it operates. Mm -hmm. And I'm saying this with all sense of respect. Possibility. Okay, moving on to the punch. No IPPIS, no pay order. FG Asu clash again. Uh, picture here, fire destroys plaza, 15 shops in Lagos. EFCC um, arranged Mena on fresh 738.6 million naira contract scam. We have expelled students in viral sex videos, says Babcock. Four gang grip an Anambra woman and collected a million naira from her. Mother of six throws day old baby in a pit. APC neck to determine Amuso Okorocha Akredo's fate. Governors reject death penalty for hate speech. PDP senators fought Buhari on the Wotrillion Naira constituency projects. And CBN, FIRS, NNPC get seven days to submit audited accounts. Okay, so which story? There are two human interests that I actually read. The fire that destroyed the plaza uh, in Jewish Aga. Um, it was start, supposedly started off by um, a spark in the shop, one of the shops, and this was about 2 a.m. and it transferred to all the shops. And the first uh, fire truck that came, there was no water. <clears throat> it was, and um, a lot of a lot of the traders are crying. Some of them had just stocked up. Yeah. One said, "Oh, he's um, he just bought a machine for two hundred and fifty thousand. Right. The printer, right. and but it's um, and unfortunately, there's nothing that's going to be done because it would be nice for the government to help them, but I don't know if that will ever happen. You, you know, um, the sad thing about this is I saw the fire because I was on my way to work on Tuesday morning, mm. and uh, I, I we actually saw it burning. My oh. driver, the fire engine was there. That means that was the fire engine without water. Oh, hmm. yeah, can you imagine?" And then... Um, Let's take the other story. There was another human interest story. That's the Babcock. The, yeah, the, Babcock. That one of the gang rape. Okay, yeah. The, the gang rape or the... The, no, the gang rape video. I mean, they, they I raped, the gang rape. I read the that video, one. The, they raped a lady. Uh, mm. uh, four men raped a lady and go hard to give them one million naira so they don't um, record or um, release the video, release the video, video of, the gang, of the rape. I wish they released and this. They actually, they actually arrested this man. So I'm happy about that. They've been arrested. And at least the, the, the investigation is ongoing, which I'm happy about. For rape and blackmail. Mm -hmm. I hope they go forever. So, <laughs> who's taking Babcock or should we move on? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, talk should you want to take the story? Mm, it's just, I, I, don't, I didn't want us to debate Okay, we can talk about it. It's, it's, actually, just a, basic it's actually a hot topic. I think we can make no, it a topic of the It's, it's mm. just that the, um, a, a, a student of Babcock was caught in a video that was released um, having sex, and it's against the rules of the university, and she was expelled. Simple. But there's a lot to talk about on that. <laughs> These are two adults, now kids. No, no it's, so it's the nature, of, school, um, the nature yeah. of parenting so, that yeah. was the old order was to put your children in religious houses so that they are raised religiously, yeah. and it doesn't necessarily translate to said, values this, and morals. This, 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 this incident is weighty. I think we need to talk about it. There's so many angles we can discuss on this angle. Let's move yeah, on. Let's make it a hot topic. Let's today, make it a hot topic and, um, and, and thrash it properly. We have to move on. Um, Daily Sun, result transmission tops new electoral bill. PNID, FG renews moves to quash contract. Uh, again, governors never meet over the bailout facility and others. Biafra, it's hate speech to call IPOP members Nigerians. Says Nam Dikano, for real. I didn't read that article. Yeah. Okay, who has the electoral bill? So the electoral bill is getting is going through reading again the new bill which is pushed by um, um, um omar gege the deputy president deputy senate president ova omar gege is pushing for straight transmission of every 
um, polling unit straight to the central database. Mm. And I think that this would quell, and for them, even that's what they said, that it will quell a lot of election malpractices. They also want to reduce the cost of running elections within the country. They also want to ensure that we do e-voting by 2023. So we're looking forward to having them actually yeah, enact the this because we are well of this. Transmission, um, bill. I, th I thought it could just have come confidently, conveniently under the Electoral Act reform. We can always review mm. the Electoral Act. I think Quick, another one is the, the, well, I, to mitigate what happened in, um, I think it was uh, mm -hmm. Kogi, yeah, yeah. where one person dies. No, what, what, um, if a person dies, yes. he said, so if a person dies before the election, the um, INEC must post the election until the party internally are able to do a electoral fresh... act. We have electoral laws yeah. in the country. They should have just brought it there. They, are still yeah, our they time. put it that any party that is caught fighting, they will disqualify the party anyway. from the... Yeah, uh, that's yeah. That, that, that's the only to way to... Hear. That is that the only way. Hear, because is that, that, everybody is hungry, so mm. I will collect money. Is that the only story to take in the Daily Sun? No other story? Okay, let's oh, there was on. another one. Oh, and let's move on to okay. the Daily Trust. Buhari signs executive order stopping open defecation. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> Lawmakers fire back at Buhari over a trillionaire constituency projects. Uh, pressure mounts on seconders to resign. Ten persons arrested, many injured as NURTW members clash. Fresh outrage as anti-social media bill scales second reading in Senate. Okay, open defecation, who has that story? So there's a bill now by, in Nigeria that will end open defecation by 2025 that the president no, has no. just... Oh, no, no. And the president has just signed. And this is because Nigeria is rated number two highest yes, in no. open defecation. And this is how the lawmakers have reacted to it. And so we have a law. But I would expect that, you know, these are simple matters that states and local governments can deal with by providing public toilets well, yeah, well. and arresting. It's, yeah. a, it's a local government matter. Yeah. And arresting people. So in the immediate, yeah. that's what, in fact, in the whole of Badagri, well, they can just People are just so used to actually, like, especially women. men. Yeah. Yeah. So it, it's normal for them to just pee outside. Yeah. Yeah. You see, so, peeing is the list of what we're talking about. Peeing is the same thing. Number two. Yeah, number, number two, two the as in the main Number one and number two, they're all together. They we want to cross where they're not constructing. You dare not cross that Badagri Expressway. Cut up my first egg. OK, moving on to Vanguard. Hey. Uh, uh, burning of country. Kogi PDP woman leader planned job says community mm. and the picture of the woman is oh this is so sad fact. oh my goodness I didn't see this paper mm. leadership tussle two fear dead scores injured as transport unions battle in Lagos hellish traffic situation temporary says Lagos State government so they're replying us saying that we should take it easy <laughs> that uh, it's they're temporary okay <clears throat> suspension I want to join issues with Olanu says Akeri Dolu probe Lagos Assembly asked court to strike out Ambodi's suit. Constituency projects reps PDP senators Taku Buhari by Elsa Guba. We have no issues with Jonathan PDP. Amnesty International declares she will rebakare Jalingo prisoners of conscience. Mm. Right. So this is the woman that got burnt mm -hmm. to death mm -hmm. in her house. And she tried to get out of this house. Unfortunately, she couldn't because really? they were actually shooting at her. Mm -hmm. So I mean, I do not understand. So what I read was they, that they fact, said, bring the perpetrators to book. Wait, why, like, what I even find more, more painful? I would like us to actually, there was, a, there was a video where the governor of the mm. state was responding to this. I would like us to listen to that video mm. and try to understand what he's communicated to us. Maybe we'll make it a topic on Monday. Because what I even heard, and unfortunately I'm not here on Monday, oh. and I would really love to be there because what I had heard that he said, mm. what I heard when I listened was, uh, it was a retaliation. You shouldn't be seen. You are a leader. You shouldn't be seen making excuses. Oh, on an out of proportion, we are uh, retaliation. Uh, there should never that, be uh, The problem That's is the that one. the politicians in that state armed those boys. The arms that they put out there is what led to the death of this woman. And people must take responsibility. I, I, I wish that the community members would be willing to identify, to, to, to you point fingers at, I saw you, I saw you, I saw you, and let they people because they were arrested. Just, they, they, they were, no, they were, but they were looking through their windows and watching how the house got So they feel, in fact, surrounded the house and made sure she couldn't me. get out. In fact, they said family members are in shock, fear of reprisal attacks. Mm. Uh, 
there's another one that says that our democracy is in danger, says Shatima. Yes. Uh, this, is, this is something that we shouldn't just sweep under the carpet. And we I think that we should, we should ensure that this woman gets justice for what was done. This we is should. totally it's barbaric so in every our sense. Crime of it doesn't increase just after... And, and this is where I'm saying election. our leaders are not being responsible. At all. Mikey, we don't have leaders. Please leave that matter. Let's move on. Okay, There's not story. The There's a story that started. Um, leadership mm -hmm. tossed two, two fair dead yes. scores injured. Yes. So fair. yesterday from around 10 a.m. till 2 p.m. at the Gondwa Keso area, there was a leadership tussle between the AURT and the RTEN. And because of that, two people died and 10 people injured. But they said they've arrested 10 persons. They just held everybody to, in traffic for hours. I ended up passing there yesterday, but I thank God that I was delayed in the Kedja traffic. Before Probably getting there, entered before. into that traffic. Okay, who has your story? Nobody has that. No, it's, it's, it's Amnesty International mm. has named Shawore Bajalingo and uh, was Shawore's um, other partner Bakari as, Bakari as prisoners of conscience because they are being held for exercising their fundamental rights mm. and they are asking the Nigerian government to to crash quash their uh, charges against the charges against them and release them. Okay, murder of Kogi woman leader. This is a major topic. In fact, I wish we can even talk about this topic right now. Mm -hmm. um, what happened in viral sex video? Babcock University explains. Mm -hmm. FG orders probe. We talked about that. And the picture here, gridlock in Lagos. Very familiar look. <laughs> this, is a, this is our state right here. Ganduje heads APC, INEC fact finding committee, committee on Edo. So the one, mil the one million probe is that we haven't discussed it. So there's a one million dollar probe. A man called. Hope Olusegun Aroke was serving his term in the Kirikiri prison. In the 24 year jail term. And he carried that. out a $1 million scam, scam from mm -hmm. within the prison. What is so, even more interesting <laughs> about this? Yo, let me tell you about it. I read the story yesterday. Mm -hmm. We didn't take it yesterday. Didn't take it. What's mm -hmm. interesting more about this guy? Mm -hmm. He would tell the, police and the, the officers in the prison that he's not feeling well. He'll get admitted into the police. Hospital. hospital. In the hospital, he gets out. So he gets discharged. No, no, no. Goes to a hotel. To a goes to a hotel with his family. They go for parties, family functions. Yeah, he do stuff, and then so, go back. So obviously, there's a total. There's a syndicate. So there, this the federal government is saying that everybody culpable will be dealt with. That I this hope. is. So what, because we know that it is there, there are people involved within the While customs. in prison, in a 24-year jail term, he was buying properties police, around police Lagos. And, um, buying properties around Lagos worth 44 million per property. Yes. You know, buying properties in choice areas. He bought it lucky. He bought Has a an nice account, house. Opens, opens accounts in, yeah. his, in a new name, in, prison, in his wife's name. I Those mean, transactions, years 12 years. 24, he was, 24 he's years. He's been no. there because for 12, 12 years, years already. Yes. But they do Since 2012. So the man is there lounging. In fact, enjoying I don't it. understand. And he's making money. And he's Let enjoying the money while the he's in prison. There's Lagos State is saying the um, uh, traffic in Lagos is due to uh, the 116 road, construction. road constructions happening in, uh, presently to all together in response to the uh, gridlock um, state of our roads that the governor is dealing with. But That's what's they, could, traffic. they could also make it easier. Just by asking the Lagos State Traffic Management, which is the agency in charge of traffic to be management, at every point. to be at every point, like the... One at yeah. Sele to uh, over it, right? Even within it's the Kedja. Even within yes. the Kedja. Because people, they, they, the that gridlock happens because we're not waiting for one yeah. another. Mm -hmm. And sometimes but the wait is just having some... Here. Just it's have somebody just say, stay, go. But unfortunately, that's all. Also. What even annoys me is when I see them driving in the opposite direction. You uh, see this tongue gets through. It's not a lot. Oh, you will see, you see, I'm telling you, you are on the lane and then they're coming in the opposite direction. What are you doing in the opposite direction? Hmm. Why think. are you disturbing the people going, you know, and... They can cause accidents. Okay, what you know? They're I'm worsening putting, this condition of no. the road. One way is happening, and that's okay. What um, is most annoying? Eh? You are you coming this way, right, left, center. We're all in the middle. Yes. yes. We're not just not looking at each other. We're yes. now locked. We're now locked. We're that's just the, that's what we're we're one last We now need one, one, one sane Nigerian to get that, which yes. is what we usually do. Go on. Eh, eh, them. Move back. Move back. The only risk to your life there is stress, uh, maybe heart attack, or mm. maybe you deliver your baby there. Uh. <laughs> but the other one is they Death. will kill you yeah, because yeah. you are they are driving it. You are not even yeah, expecting yeah. them in that direction. Unfortunately, that's, that's all we can take. That's, that's their work. Unfortunately, that's all we can take on front yeah. page review. Of course, uh. this is this has gone. In fact, I feel that we should we should squash all our hot topics and focus on this this matter because it seems like uh, it's, uh, uh, our it's blood is burning. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Welcome back to Your View. 
Thanks for staying with us. So there are loads and loads of topics to talk about today. Usually Thursday is our gisting topic, but we just thought, you know what, there are, there are so many things that are bothering Nigerians at this point, and we think it's uh, our responsibility to bring some of these issues, and one of which is um, traffic is a major thing. And I think Lagos State has responded already that they are constructing across the state, and we should be patient. And we should be patient. So whether we like it or not, at least it's, just, it's temporary. Um, Mariah, see, for me, I, I can understand that we need to be patient with the government. And, and I, I, I can see that construction work is going on in almost every area. There's speedy patch, so we must applaud that. But when you are doing constructions during the daytime in strategic locations where you have schools closing or you have um, offices closing hours, you should always have the management, the last mile officials conducting traffic. What ends up happening is there's a gridlock. People block each other and they're all waiting for that same Nigerian to come out and beg people to move back a bit. But if we have traffic officials at every point, and I know that they are recruiting because they have some new guys um, working with white the last mile in wearing white shirts, but you see them in clusters, four with one that is in uniform, and they are just sitting down, just saying, not enough work going on to clear traffic on the roads. No. I, I think that, that that's I, I think, think that's would, the feedback mm, that we need to give back yes, to the government to ensure really that to they that. need to have more people out there. Um, yes, why can, can I say something? I take it to a different angle because you see, we are, we are always fond of blaming the government, mm. and I will not be, I will not be found wanting. I, if I think government is to blame, I will blame government. But let us even look in Within. the mirror, because. Um, Yes, they, uh, maybe government gave you the work. Go and do this work. Mm. Do it on Saturday and Sunday. You will not. You will rest on Saturday and Sunday. And Saturday then you will now come on Monday <laughs> when it is traffic time, mm. and then you will start repairing Russia. the road. When they have given you the contract to do it on Saturday and Sunday mm. in the nights we'll when there the are no nights. cars, you will now come on Monday. You have collected the money. You have collected the contract, and then you will do it, and then you will make your fellow citizens suffer. <laughs> in pain, mm. in traffic. Is it fair? Mm. Should we please start to look at ourselves in the mirror? Mm. Now, the Okadas, say the Okadas that are going the opposite direction, are they, <laughs> Okadas uh, have no are, road. are they governments? All the road is up for mm. Okada, any mm. area of the road. Especially then they will abuse you mm. when you even try to correct them that why are you coming in this direction? Come on, get out. Even the, uh -huh. even the new ones, the green bikes, oh. like for that for whatever reason, they are allowed to go apply the expressways. Because in the past, they stopped the, uh, yeah. the, the bikes from going on the express. These ones are allowed. Mm. So you see them on Third Milan Bridge. You see them everywhere on the major, on the major roadways. They just come to the next year and wonder, ah, where did that so come from? Green and yellow. No traffic laws. So YK, YK is very correct on the our own side. So we should look at the mirror, look in the mirror and see ourselves first, and then government side. Unfortunately, the hours I drive and the number of roads I drive, you you cannot come and tell me I don't know what I'm telling you. If, for instance, because the Badagri, oh, uh, sorry, the Apapa Uwuru axis of the roads construction site, and I was liaising with a top government official on how the roads were going to happen. And they locked down from Oshodi, starting from the airport, all the way to Sele. They locked down, they were constructing there and fixing the roads. If at the time they started work, immediately the agencies that should partner took the initiative to partner and start to you know, understand the, the road. Because on the service lane of these two roads mm. is a regular one way that has become the norm. Mm. Now, you know that you are constructing the middle of the road. Those service lanes are the only alternative. Immediately, government agencies that are authority on road should issues should be way. on that road to ensure that those right. one ways are no longer the norm, so that traffic that is ingoing will be ingoing, ongoing will be ongoing, no clashes. Yeah. Right. Unfortunately for us, that is not what is happening. Mm. So now they've moved, and they've not finished that side of the road to Sele, but they've moved now to the Osho de Sele to Osho the road. Mm. And the same issues that we suffered in the afternoons we suffer now in the Someone morning. Someone was telling me about yeah. I said I was saying it on the show the other day that if 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 it was just even easy for you to just cite one that was not doing something, maybe it would bring you relief. Talk less of the one that is doing something. And it would seem like we were being too harsh because one agency would say, No, it's rather harsh of the way the way you said it. But these officials are not doing anything. It's most likely that they resume after a pass. Mm. Most likely. So I wonder what time they resume. What time exactly okay. should road, so I guess road traffic need... be controlled? And should they even have closing hours? Should they, should, this is an important agency, are essential to the livelihood of people. Should it be a 24 7 so, business? When the governor came into power, he extended the time schedule and we discussed it on the show. 
of the last mile officials, saying that we are, last mile officials will now resume from 6 a.m. in the morning and work till 9 p.m. They will work on two shifts. And that was his statement. So we also had a, a law on ground signed by the Fashola administration saying that um, um, motorcycles shouldn't ply specific two carriage roads and expresses. So when we have rule, um, laws like this signed and then a new government comes and it, they behave like it, those laws don't exist, what, what, was it not thought through before when they signed those laws before? Because they knew that this was putting lives in danger and it was costing people. So it, let me be sure we're on the same page. So what we're saying pretty much issues. is that we agree that they're constructing roads. Yes. And we agree and we understand that there's no way there'll be traffic. Mm -hmm. All we're asking for, ensure that the last mile officials are at Amanda every Jimmy's... single junction. Oh. Yes. We have people to ensure that. Every, and at no, the same every, time, every, every, on, and at the same time, we Nigerians also must also look in the mirror and ensure we're not playing the, the, the one ways. Mm -hmm. And we're also waiting for each and other. Why can that thing is so basic? We don't wait for each other. No, right, sometimes when I wait, I get, I get frustrated. I'm the good person. I'm waiting. Film, 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 film. Uh -uh. All of you saw that I waited, and you just yes. do not think that you should also wait so and let me pass. Is, let me give Mariah right, a vivid right, picture say, of sorry, waiting. Ma, so Another one. Yesterday. Yes, that's why I say, look in the mirror. Mm -hmm. Because you will now be the one. Tired. Do we, okay, do we now you will join them. Yeah. Let me okay, just go. Okay, I'll come to you, Nima. Mm -hmm. There's one more look in the mirror. On those narrow roads, Nigerians will park on the road and go and visit uh -huh. somebody. Mm. You go and park so you, you, you park on the road. You don't want to buy, buy something. Buy All of us are there trying to maneuver and you're yeah. parked on the Nigerians narrow road. Nigerians are not the ones parking on the road. On these service lanes, the two dimensions, trucks are legally, mm. because once what is allowed is legal, mm. legally parked on the road. So that one two-way drive will now be cra uh, clashing, uh, cra crashing into one because the trucks will not move. Mm. And authority would not just see it. Mm. Mm. Uh, That's one. Number two, yesterday, I was pass coming from Lasso. Just because they've opened, while construction is happening, they've opened one small side of the road, mm. one-way drives, mm. and the police are just down there collecting money. One-way drive is now legitimate. So they will block you coming from Lasso at Yanoba. You will just be there. Because I want to, until they hit my car yesterday, I did not go mad. Aww. When somebody hits my car, I went mad. I started trying to pass by force. Because just, you cannot be patient mm. in that kind of situation. Something. You see... The one that even pains me the most, I have to say this one, is a downfall. He would have stopped in the middle of the road to pick his passengers. passengers. Mm -hmm. And he doesn't care that you are behind and you have somewhere to go. He will stop. Yeah, he then will. you will now come out to try and maneuver. And then he will come to out. Go. He will then then he will now come out again. Mm. So the issues... And, and then, then he will now block you and then stop again in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling we you. We have enough laws to guide us. It's about uh, implementation. And it's, enforcement. It's, there was a time in this state that there was order. Okay, and have, I, I feel nostalgic one. about those yeah. periods where we were driving and there was sanity. People were forced. They did a BRT lane, Rayo. It was a rule that no yellow bus should ply the express or BRT lane. They should, the yellow bus should be on the service lane. And we saw sanity on the expressway. All those rules meant to make us sane and drive safely. All of them are being disregarded. If you can okay, just I, I, I need to go on a break. No, okay, no, I need to go on a break. We'll continue I, the conversation. We're going, to, we're going to continue when yeah, you come yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. Stay with us. <laughs> we'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Welcome back to Your View. <laughs> Thanks for staying with us. Trust me, you don't want to hear the conversation that happened during the ha, day. It was the heated. entire studio was heated because people obviously feel this pressure of traffic. Why can't you have some tweets for us? Yes, Honorable Ademola Alalade says, mm -hmm. road works cannot be done at night in Nigeria simply <coughs> because electricity is not constant. Ha. The only alternative is to curb those but who violate traffic Lagos. laws and, and it's constant fine. The, the only alternative to cop those who violate traffic laws is constant fine. And you will be surprised how people will conform. Nigerians always reset their brains with fines. Mm. Um, and he says, time, time there was, at Timo speaks, time there was order. You had fewer cars then, and there will be more cars in the future. My point, so long as you don't complete the rail project started by Fashola, traffic mm. will That's always be this said. bad or worse. Everybody has been talking about Fashola last time. Yes, yeah, Tolani, mean, Robert says, Lagos residents don't realize they spend half of their life in traffic. Right. Mm -hmm. And I mean, the best, the best part that of our time. That is not living. 
Mm. Living in Lagos is the ultimate rat race. Mm. Mm. So for me, I think that we need to keep on saying this over and over again so that our leaders understand what the citizens want. This is how we will judge you. We will judge you based on how easy our lives become under your dispensation. So. You and more. right now, it is tough. So we hear, whenever we, I engage um, government officials in Lagos, they'll be like, there's no money, there's no money. And I was telling Mariah now that we don't need extra money to put order because we have last month officials getting paid. Hell, hold them to the highest level of competence. Let them deliver. We have tax forces getting paid. Let them deliver. We have um, environmental CAI getting paid. We have environmental agency getting paid. We have last month getting paid. There is enough money in circulation to keep Nigeria, Lagos in order. It is just about efficiency. So, so people should, there shouldn't be lag time. I engaged people are suffering. an official of the last month before, and one of the excuses was that it's not easy to, to, to man certain terrain. Mm. That's a crazy and I agree. There. No, I have some terrains that are some really, I've, really. I've seen somewhere I've wondered what is people wrong. People have with this died, people have We've killed seen, last month officials. We, yes, in this Lagos state. Should, yeah. Honestly, yes. We've seen videos of Nigerians go crazy. But what we have is that when you prosecute and jail somebody for these offenses, there will be deterrence. But that to say that because of one or two incidences, there will be no management of traffic at all, that people on that axis of town will not feel your presence, mm. feel government at all. Mm. It's on, it's, Let it's, me it's take this call from Oluwashio, calling from the UK. Oluwashio, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Good Thanks morning, for calling. Good morning. Go ahead, please. Good morning. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Eva, good morning. I uh, wish everyone down there. Yeah. And this is a first time caller. So I Welcome, to the show. <laughs> Welcome to the show. <laughs> Thank you very much. Anyway, talking about the Nigerian I and mean, the Lagos traffic, um, it's always been there. I think we need more of the towing van <laughs> than yes. even the people that are working, the last mile, what we call them. Maybe when the towing van works well, like they start picking people's car, you go you know, one way and they pick your car, <laughs> then maybe we'll be happy. Mm. Because Thank at the end of the day, the they, they last two are there, they are not doing their job. Mm. And if at all they are meant to do their job, they are still going to get bribed from the people picking the wrong way. Right. But if we have the towing van, mm. you misbehave, you've been told, and you have to pay money to get your car back. Mm. I think Thank then you. maybe we negotiate, we have enough things. Thank you very much, Elwashio. Somebody was, uh, I was having a conversation with somebody, and they were saying that he, if he had money, he would invest in those crushing machines. Mm -hmm. So the towing van would tow your vehicle away, take it to the towing yard, and they crush your vehicle into this small box mm -hmm. and throw it in the dustbin. Mm -hmm. So if we have those crushing machines, because because many cars we have, are there are so many, so many cars parked on the road. They are parked on the road and they are all obstructing traffic. So what are we going to do to those vehicles? What are we, what are, uh, that uh, are Honorable, Honorable Ade Molalala, I, I believe that we must address this tweet. He's saying that they can't do construction work at night. No, I worked Thank for you. years shooting music videos and we can shoot videos at night. You have a generator, you power a 2K, 4K uh, light. They would work at night. Um, they can work at night. Light that's light that's light 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 if he says we don't have constant light, during the day, is there constant light? Abi? <laughs> they don't need light during the day because they, 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 they can see. They can at see. night, they can't see. But no. you can have generator power major um, heavy duty lights that will light up your way so that you can walk. Ooh, but we that, must... that light was not in their budget when they got the contract. Mm. What they, what, yes, now. Uh, they, they should start putting it in their budget. Uh, they, they if, if, if a welder comes to my house to come and weld, I don't let him use my generator if there's no light. Mm. He has to have budgeted that the generator. Yeah. Uh, generator that was, because generator welding machines for the spoils the generator. Mm -hmm. This is what we could see. Look, so, that in the pictures are. This, so, uh, no, uh, uh, well, this is, this is, this is no, this is not a Photoshop. This is not a this Photoshop. Is no, this is not a this this this, this like can you see the green the uh, green, green buses? Ah, this please. is Abuja. Don't don't embarrass us like that. No. This is not Lagos. But, this but, is not but, not that bad. This has happened on this motorway to our motorway. Vegas. Yesterday, <laughs> I was driving my car hung like this. You know, yeah, I wanted to do all those funny oh. moves to go down and oh, enter the road. Don't do that though. I did it. I my car was I felt my car was pitched. The car is in land. Don't you try to drive it? There's a way to drive. Don't drive it regularly. As if when I finish your car, that your tire. Don't wonder. When I don't try that stuff. I finished Honda escaping, cars. everybody was saying, ah, madam, 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 lucky. madam, because no, they knew that you, in Lagos, you, that with only you get a little bit of insanity get from just in Lagos driving. State. Anyways, unfortunately, we have uh, to wrap up on uh, this. Why I wanted you to give uh, us the solutions. I was giving um, solutions because we don't have a good quality, especially people who are sleeping, um, going to, having to wake up at three, they don't get home till midnight. First of all, I think the government should do adverts mm. telling us areas what to do, you know, 
how to behave. Listen, proper driving. Uh, yes, proper driving, proper, um, you know, giving, and then maybe incentives mm. to, like these people, don't, if you don't stop on the road, you, you know, so that way, maybe it will start to enter our conscience. Okay. Conscience. Yeah, really so, I have a call from Hassan. Hassan has call. been holding for a while. Good morning, Hello, sir. Hello, good morning. Good morning, mm. sir. Thanks for calling. Good morning, all of you. Um, please, uh, let us get to understand one thing about Lagos Gridlock. All over Lagos, including Apapa, is a business. Hmm. It's Commercialization. A business for law enforcement agencies paid by government to control the traffic. Let us call a spade a spade. Mm -hmm. Look, Ambode constructed flyover in Aja. Up till tomorrow, people are experiencing the problem because the last month, the police and whosoever is involved in controlling traffic are extorting money mm. from these transporters. Breaking laws in Lagos is for sale as mm, far as traffic mm. is concerned. Mm. Make sure you have your money. Give them the money and you get out of it. That is why you will see a very long traffic. When you get to the end of it, you will not see anything. Not see anything. The same thing with the papa. Federal government are not ready to deal with the problem in the papa. Let me tell you. Let them go into the port. Mm. Remove the barricades. You understand? Mm. The government is culpable to this a papa issue. They have allowed corruption to develop mm. to a state of a monster. Right. I love you, Hassan. They have allowed other ranks to control the traffic. Mm. And that is why now, People are making money. It's now become a business venture right. for the people in charge of traffic. Thank you very much, Hassan. Thank, Thank you very much. much. He has yeah. quit that slap for you. He has Thank said you. it. He has said it. He has said it. He has said it. Like, yeah, you are living on a uh, satellite tower on Mara Road. You no, see he lives them pay money. Yeah. Yeah. Or, or anyway, maybe a papa. He has has maybe a papa. He has to go to a papa for work. So a two girl says, the traffic in Lagos will still be bad even with good roads. Where there is no consequence for action, people will constantly default. We need to do better as the people. Dolani Robert says, in, if Lagos is the third most stressful city in the world, then I salute all the young people hustling under the tense atmosphere. Maybe May you not die young, oh. May your hustle pay. Mm. Uh, Femi speaks, says, Lagos traffic. Fashion last year did loads of road repair, yet there was no grid lock as this. I will, I will advise the current governor what meet with Fashion Last period. I think, right, I think, I think uh, efficiency. Yes, yes. I, I think we are even forgetting because yes, there was traffic. Mm. There was traffic, which is why when, uh, like this um, third mainland bridge, mm -hmm. oh, okay. that's why when Ambode came, Ambode did that layover yeah, like, because of that third mainland it, traffic. So yeah. there was traffic, but what has managed. happened now is just utter chaos. Mm. Mm. It's utter it chaos. As chaos it's, we, as we, we have just, we have Let me take this call from Abdul. Abdul, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Thanks Good for morning. calling. Go ahead, please. Yeah, good morning, beautiful morning. ladies. Uh, first of all, uh, I want to commend you guys. You are doing a fantastic job. Thank you, Thank sir. Thank you. Um, uh, YK and the last caller, uh, Azan, have, have said it all. You know, you can't reinvent the wheel. <sighs> Somebody has put laws in place, and those laws were enforced, and traffic was excellent in Lagos. Okay, let them just enforce traffic laws. This construction thing and all, that's not the problem. It's not. This, this is not the first uh, uh, state that will be having uh, construction. And how many constructions are we even talking about? We're talking about 100 and something roads. Do you know how many roads are in Lagos? So all the, the government should enforce the, the, ball, the ball stops on the, stable, on, the stable, on the stable. They should just enforce traffic laws, and I can guarantee you it will reduce this traffic by 50 percent. Mm. Thank you very much, and God bless so, you. Thank all. you so much. You. Somebody has said something during the life. What was well, the difference between fashion last time and down? Is fact was efficiency, mm -hmm. and the fact that it was like see fashion was, was on ground. It was answered. So it wasn't it wasn't depending on the one commissioner to say, oh, don't worry, sir, we're handling it. You, he will go there himself. He calls or he will call. Or why is speak. this spoiling under your watch? And he knows who to call at every point in time. So exactly. and people had access to him. So maybe that's the difference. We need, we, need to, we need to see the posture of the, of this government that they're actually involved in, mm -hmm. in what is going on. They know his phone number the, was there for um, you to the call him. That are at hand. Send him a text if, if he doesn't pick up, send him a text, he will read your text. Yes. So, I mean, Fashola was, I mean, you know, now we are now we are going back to Fashola. Yeah. Same when Nigerians are going back to Jonathan Spiro. Let me take hey. Jonathan Jonathan's Spiro was very democratic. Oh. Yeah. 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 Now, yeah. sometimes you marry two, three wives, you now know yeah. the difference. Yeah. You know okay. the one that is still so, the soup was sweet. We have, so, unfortunately, so. we have to wrap up okay. on this. Just take a few tweets and I'll run. Kaya Dekaka says, The fault is us, the human being is the man 
is the man is not disciplined. Your vehicle cannot obstruct. The um, Yaro says there's no deliberate action to cost Lagosians any pain. Mm. The present situation is temporary. The contractors are speeding up their jobs and they are being encouraged to work at night where possible, even as motorists are being advised to use alternatives. We have to go on a this break. When we come Lagos back, we'll take another topic. I'm not sure which one yet, either the Babcock School or the this Salo, some late Mrs. Salome Abu, because mm -hmm. uh, this is a story we're not going to leave. We're going to keep talking about it yes. because we must get this one must get justice. Mm -hmm. And we, 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 uh, many Nigerians feel that they should hold mm -hmm. the government responsible for her death. So we're still. I, will, I want it, There's a video of the governor's response that I'd like to show, but unfortunately, it doesn't be edited because it's a long interview. But I wanted to just capture how he responded to this incident because I wanted Nigerians to hear what he said and let us hear your own thoughts on it. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Welcome back to Your View. Thanks for staying with us. All right, let's take a few tweets. I know lots of tweets have come oh, okay. for this last topic. Mikey. Avoid Lagos traffic. Says Lagos traffic can only be reduced if the government can create more bridges on the sea, and then there will be less traffic on the present major roads. Mm -hmm. Um, the Kiss Mafia says there was no there was no proper planning. The lanes are now narrow for a mega city like Lagos. Indiscriminate parking within Lagos um, and abandoned vehicles taking up an already small space. Lagos State Government needs to explore more options to road transport. Solani uh, Robert says Lagos traffic will make you sit inside a jeep <laughs> and be admiring people on Okada. The story of my life. And this one is Andrew in Streatham says. I deliberately avoid Lagos traffic debate. Why? It even stresses me from London. So. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, that's all we can take on that. Um, you know what? I think we'll um, let's be careful. Mm. You know, I don't think because I would I would love to discuss um, the death of this woman, but I think I would rather not because a woman just got burned alive. Let us be careful. Make us not put our families in danger. Let us just. Let's just move. Hey, I don't know if they not bonus, but let us just not talk about this matter because I'm, I'm, I, I fear as a Nigerian, maybe in future when it has died down, as a Nigerian, I fear to talk about it. When it if you can burn a woman alive, you bring it what is, who am I? That, uh, yes. Why we will, will we not be scared as Nigerians Stop when where? we have court cases that has released Soare? And they and are not being released. I'm scared. You know, every time I'm talking here, Seth, I, I, I think about hmm. it that. Mumara, be careful. I need to hmm. be more careful yes. because, and that's not what democracy should Don't be about. Don't that matter. Let's move on to a nice story, please. Uh, oh, let yes. us move on to Easy a easy story, please. Yes, let's move on to issues. Okay, so should we just look at ourselves like Don't chickens? worry. Don't worry. Right? We are chickens. So now, a story right? circulating online about the kind of story they want to talk about. Let me talk about that, please. A story circulating online about an American basketball player, Lamar Odom who, according to report, recently got engaged to his girlfriend of four months. Things took a twist also on the same social media when his 17-year-old son took to his Instagram page to show his displeasure about the marriage proposal. So we ask, how important is a child's approval to a parent's engagement or marriage? You can join the conversation on 070. 8066 You can also tweet to us at TVC Connect. Please hashtag your view TVC so we can read your tweets. Right. <laughs> what are your thoughts on that? Huh? What's going on? No, because we just came from a very, very high mountain. But uh, we need to discuss the kind of stories they like us to discuss. Mm. So, women's stories, eh? Yes, women's stories. The one that would distract us eh? from eh? the realities of our life. Talk about, please talk about Lama. Big. Okay, so eh? Lama mm -hmm. is a popular basketballer. Yes. Um, He's had a lot of social media attention to himself recently and he just got engaged and his 17 year old son says he doesn't approve of it. And I feel that um, a lot of children should let their parents have a life. Um, we tend to personalize our parents. As a parent, I look at my son and I remind myself every day, one day, <laughs> these children will come and tell me, Kinika Kinika is the love of my life. Yeah. I love her with everything. She's now number right. one. And you must accept that. We must, I, I am prepared to accept the fact that my, my sons will fall in love with another woman and that woman will take precedence over me. And I think that children sh too should be willing to let their parents have a life. So when uh, parents are divorced or parents are we're, we're, we're single parents, they should be allowed to have relationships without the child feeling jealous of his or our parents, whether it's male or female, moving on. That, that's, 
Why can your thoughts on this? What? Ah, this became to you because you know you have been in the what? you have been in the situation. You know me, I've been in traffic too. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but um, the truth of the matter is, I, I think as parents, does your wife, does your daughter accept of you, uh, uh, approve yeah, of your relationship? Yes, she does. But that is because over the years, I I wasn't throwing people yeah. in front of her. Oh, this is my... Yeah, look, I kept my private life private. Right. And that is private from my child. And w where do you come up getting engaged without telling your family that, oh, mm. I'm getting engaged? Mm. Four and then, months. Four months is really I, short. Four, four months, I, I don't even want to go to that, but I, I think it's... It's disrespect mm. to not tell your kids. No, but if you told them and they didn't agree, yeah. that's what we're saying, that they did not agree. Oh, no, this yeah, one said that he, they didn't tell you, that's on Instagram. Yeah. So that's where he got he angry from. Reacted from the Instagram page. I mean, this is not really my business. <laughs> that's the truth. Mm. But I'm just saying, what, from what I saw, so I, yeah. if I had been him, would have said, oh, my son, I'm getting married, though. Yeah. Okay. So but Ima, the question is, who is the guardian? Is it the son who is his guardian or he who is his? I don't understand because it's in his son's choice that he has a stake. Mm. It's not in his own choice. Even now, they don't even have choice in their children's stake. If the person is above it, he can marry who he likes. Yeah. But the guardian, this is an adult parent, and I think he should be free to do what he wants to do. I personally don't really care. What, we, what my parents would want to do with their lives. I think that we really don't want to discuss this topic. <laughs> okay, we're going to break. When we come back, We'll continue. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Welcome back to Your View. Thanks for staying with us. So, on the papers today, there was a story about Babcock University um, exp uh, expelling two students uh, because of a viral video. It was actually a sex video. Um, a young lady went to visit her boyfriend who had actually been expelled already, I think, from, back school. from the same university. I think they allegedly said he was um, a drug addict, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm saying. Yeah. Um, so he had been expelled a year before. And this girlfriend went over to, his, to, to her boyfriend's house. And then hospital. The, in April. Hospital. To go and meet him in the hospital, actually in the rehab center. Yeah, mm -hmm. in, the, in the rehab center. So wait, no. And then. They had sex and um, they recorded themselves, two adults. And now, for whatever reason, the, the video got leaked. And now it's gone viral. Now, the girl who actually was a student of Babcock was expelled. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I really hate to put too much focus on, on the act because these are two consenting adults and I don't want us to focus on the act. But the, the, the issue I'm having here is this, this um, new trend of recording each other and sharing videos, sex videos, uh, naked videos, or, or pictures of ourselves to people, I think with something we need to really discuss and address, especially young people doing it so carelessly. So, Moira, yesterday when we were talking about um, the, we talked about something yesterday that made me think about choices that we make. So people, the decision to do something bad is a choice. And you must believe that and or you understand that there will be consequences. When I saw this, this, I didn't see the video, the news, I opened up and I saw the girl's face voluntarily. So I thought, ah, where is the boy's face? I want to know the boy that, you know. But this. the girl was, she, so she made a choice to do something and she put her face out there. She cannot now, yes, she was a private, it private video. was a supposed to, supposedly, because this, according to the school, it happens far back in April, and they've asked her, and it happened, it didn't happen within the school premises, it happened at a hospital in Abeokuta. But this was a choice that she made, whether to satisfy boyfriend, or to, or to we, 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 fantasy. we, I, there's no, I could, I had to call my husband that, are we doing the right thing? Because those days, parenting was easy because you just send your child to one religious place or this, and that's it. I don't want to bring parenting No, here. no, there's no let, how. Let, let, there's let, no let, how. Let, this let, is let, a religious... Let, 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 let's, 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 let's put it, break it in parts. Mm -hmm. First of all, yes, they were having sex. These are two, they're not kids. They're mm -hmm. two adults mm -hmm. and they're in university. Mm -hmm. So I don't want us to be hypocritical about this. Mm -hmm. These things happen. The issue is not that, it's not that the fact that it happened. The, that is... Mm -mm. Hypocritical about these things happening is the issue itself for me. 
So you put a child in a religious institution, but the child is not oh, even so morally issue, upright. Okay, your issue is that the so Babcock University the, must be a religious the institution. The sort of choice that she, the child would okay, make is not morally upright. So that's where I was worried. Who the child would not... Who defines as morally upright? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk so for, values. for me, I think that... Oh. As a Christian, I understand the values the Bible preaches about chastity and all of that, and I'll continue to um, push it. But I relate with young people. I relate to young people that have emotions and they are in love with someone and they feel like I want to keep that relationship going. And so in most cases, mm -hmm. pressure on both sides get them involved in having this activity. So we must begin as a society to preach safe sex and we must be begin as a society to preach not sending nudes to your partner. What about abstinence? We must. We, of, that, that, uh, that, I started on that note. Chastity. Abstinence is a given. We, we started, I, I started by saying your abstinence. But when we say abstinence, and we don't give options, we have pregnancies, we have um, STDs. STDs, and we have things that, this kind of things going viral. Have that conversation with that teenager and let teenager understand that you must never allow yourself under any pressure, send pictures of yourself nude to anybody. Or record it for or keeps. Or record it for keeps, oh, because oh. the truth is, this guy that you think loves you, in the case of this girl, she did it for the guy. They did it together. She was a willing participant. The guy shared it with his friend. His friend shared it with his girlfriend. His girlfriend, beefing the girl, licked it. So you don't know how far things will go. Don't do it. Mm. Um, do you think they should have been expelled? Of course. That's a debate. One. Uh, well, so because I have this tweet here, and she says there are two consenting adults, it's um, Tata J. She says there are two consenting adults, and the act was performed outside the school premises, for God's sake. I do not support the act, but mm. ex I, I do not support the act, but expelling them yeah, due to so their private life. Okay, thank you for bringing that up, because that, that's pretty important, because that's, uh, that's the hypocrisy Abba. part of it. These things happen. Don't as much caught. as the university would like to say, oh, we're a Christian university. Listen, there are young people there, and these things are happening. Maybe not, your Maybe not in your premises, but it's happening. So is it because this girl was caught? Uh, no, it's because the video went viral. That, they, mm, it's not so about being caught. Lose. It's because the video went viral, and indecent and immoral conduct was promoted that the school has to take a stand. Mm. Mm. If we don't put consequences to action, we cannot be. We cannot say anything. Mm. Let's cook my just. Let, uh, let's leave everybody. Yeah, I, okay, just because I'm married to Zib now, now I'm going to post video of me. I'm, I'm, that was, I'm was stupid. Post it. See, let me tell you, my Somebody mom. Somebody did it out of malicious so intent. Okay, like yeah. that's a different thing. No, no, no. That, that's, that's, that's what thing. happened. That's the that's issue. What happened. It was malicious intent. Even so, with your husband. She didn't post it. Even see me. It, even with wait, your husband. Wait, let me address what Waiki just said. No, it was. She didn't do it intentionally. Yes. Somebody else did it. She did it intentionally. She didn't post it intentionally. The posting is the Postner is not intentional. Oh. Her act, my point is that, are we judging the act or are we judging the, vi the viral video? We are, if we are ju judging the viral video, it's not her that should be, that should I be. I think um, the school just um, decided that she's not fit punished for and that. proper. I, I, let, let, let's come to this place. Because that's where the hypocrisy comes in. Hypocrisy. That's the hypocrisy we, part of it. Because hypocrisy. she's not the only one having sex so, in the school. has to take a stand but, against him But don't do the video, even with your husband. This is our phone, eh? They, are, they crack they are it, they lick it, they do everything. Yes, there is no security with these things. Mm -hmm. So you might as well think that I've done something in secret or that is a private thing between my partner and I or my husband or my wife and I. It is not private. Remember There's that, nothing Baba? private that on social one, media. Baba won't live like this. Yes, now. Two, years, yes. two or three years ago. Old people. Old people. They <laughs> Let me take this call from no, uh, Laja. Are you there? Thanks do for it. calling. Yes, good morning. Morning, sir. How are you? Long Very time. good. Yes, sir. How are you? Oh, Galaja is that you? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> good, to, good to have you on the show. Go ahead. Yes, um, I, the first topic about uh, the breeding of invaders yes. is what I want to comment about. Go ahead. It's your view. First of all, I. It's breaking, sir. We can't hear you very well. Mm -hmm. You know, I am very well okay, go ahead. You should be clear now. <laughs> <laughs> are you hearing me? Yes. yes, we're listening. Okay. I want to remind us all that uh, Femi, Femi Amzat, the deputy governor, mm -hmm. yes. used to be a commissioner of what and infrastructure on the Fatula. Yes. Okay. And he should be able to lend a voice, his experience. He's a very, very knowledgeable. An experienced man, mm. and he should, he should be able to handle 
this, if he's put in charge of this uh, problem, I'm sure he should be able to sort out one or two things. About those uh, children, it's unfortunate. Yeah, There's yeah, nothing yeah. wrong in the school expelling them. It's a shame of the school. If they retain them in that school, they'll be promoting this, yes. Yeah. Right. Thank you very much, Mr. Martins. So you're saying that if they retain them in school, what they're saying yeah, is permitted. that they're promoting yes. mm. It's permitted. So you, 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 well, it goes to be... back to what we talked about a few days ago. What was that? Is that the best way to help children no, through no. this? No, let, let, let's think about it. Must you always throw the baby out with the bathwater? So, so there's, there's, there's it's the some, easiest there's, thing to do. The assumption yeah. should be that they are... Um, um, counseling, there's information to these people so that they are aware of the things they should and shouldn't do. She could when be you now disobey, mm. you must be punished. They, and they the punishment. Not the school premises, though. Mm. They were not in school, though. So we have a policy were, of don't they, get caught. You uh, can steal, but no, don't no, get caught. Uh, so that's what that, 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 Because I heard you saying your phone, eh? The first thing you should know about your phone is don't dash your phone out if you don't need it again. Keep your phone because all the information, they can get it back. Yeah. So your phone is your phone. When you don't need it, put it inside your drawer mm -hmm. and leave it there mm. till either you die or the phone dies. Mm. <laughs> don't give out your that's phone if you don't side. need it. That's no, number one. Mm -hmm. Back to the issue I, of I don't, why, why these children were exposed. Now, why now this, this girl is a victim, as far as I'm concerned. Oh. I'm listening. Actually, I am not was, saying, I'm not saying they were, uh, victim fornication victim. is good or anything. Mm. I am saying this girl, she's the only one that her picture is, her, video, her yeah. face is in the video. Four that's girls. number one. The newspapers, yeah. In the, in, the, in the video, yeah. I don't know about newspapers, yeah, right, right. but in the video, it's her face that is there. Oh. So she, and she didn't do it, and then, oh, I have enjoyed having sex, let me post it. Somebody oh. did it out of malicious intent. Yeah. Now, that person that did it Nobody will go scot free. There. No, no, that person cannot go scot free. Uh, how? The that, person published, go that person published something that, scan that scandalized her life. So, so can so this girl? Yes, she can, her. civilly, yes. So she did not. That's a pri was. private yeah. matter. But I, I, let's come back to the issue of her making a choice that damaging. Uh, now she know who do video now. Yeah. Okay. Now so she so she can actually she can actually file a civil. If you read the story properly. The story said uh, they, they had put the phone. They were recording themselves. Yeah. Yes. It's no. There was no third party inside the room. Yeah. So they are yeah, consensually. The, the boyfriend now shed, sh showed. And his that friend, is listen, boyfriend should be liable. His boyfriend then. showed his friend mm -hmm. the video. Friend. Listen. Mm -hmm. Then he went to sleep. Mm. The friend now took the phone and sent it to himself. Mm. When that one's girlfriend now saw Please. the video, she shared it so to the world. other Why people. The well, then one is. of those other people put it all sharers in the open. So so all liable. sharers are liable. Okay. So the point is because so, so these be sharers. Yes. Don't do we it. We get that point, but I want to go. No, no, no. Because no, 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 the relationship might break, mm. don't do it. Because mm. we think, we, me, I have spoken to a lot of young people, and that emotion, the love, and everything makes them feel like shark, this shark. is my person for life. Nothing will come between us. Our relationship is forever. And in such cases, we are willing to do anything to secure the relationship. Don't do it. I have one niece that I suspect might be in this kind of cousin, actually, that I suspect might be in this kind of relationship because she's so stupid. <laughs> And every time I try to tell her the same story my mother told me, my mother would tell you, if one boy toasts you, break your heart, and he slept with you, he would tell his friend. His friend will come back, toast you, he will date you, and he'll tell another friend. So you're being um, recycled. That's one. Then it happened to a friend while I was growing up, and she was being blackmailed. And immediately, relationships in the does just, just not appeal again. And I always look at my cousin, she just doesn't get it. It's love. She's loving, she opens up, she just goes there, she just, she just breaks her own privacy. And this is a choice that she's making. Tomorrow, fast forward, she's in this situation, and then she's crying, and she expects me to hug her. I'll call you that you were being stupid. You should take responsibility. This girl is 20 years old. Mm, mm. And she was 20 years old at the time the video was made in April. Mm -hmm. She's not a baby. No. She should be, she should be take, able to take responsibility for herself, her mm. privacy, and protect okay, herself. So she's empowered with the knowledge. Not enough with the bashing. So mm -hmm. how do we help this young girl? recover from this? What, what, what are the things we can do to help her? Because obviously her face is out there mm. and she really needs to um, take, no, take, yeah, take responsibility here, yeah, but at the same time she must have find a way to live through I, this. I want to beg her parents not to cast her out. Mm. You know, because that's what, a lot of times the shame of this child, ah, uh, my child did this, we would emotionally cast out the child that is vulnerable. 
a child that has done this and has mm. been received this kind of bashing, she is vulnerable. And suicide has increased a lot in this country. She don't the parents, please parents, offer. don't cast her out. Please parents, don't throw it in her face all the time. Ah, that's how you lost your opportunity to go to school. Ah, you use sex to do. Don't throw it in her face every time because you're weighing her down. And I think that ev the uh, entire circle of friends should protect her now. Yeah. Call her, check on people, her, show her love. People make mistakes all the time. People, things happen. Life happens to everybody. And I think we should use the opportunity okay. as a, 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 an opportunity to, to teach certain lessons. It's a, we need to make uh, people understand that it's a, this, it's a learning curve. You go past it and you move on. Bigger things will happen in life. So mm -hmm. we need to help her through this. I'd also like to talk to parents like who think that, you know, to raise children is to dump them somewhere, that that institution will raise them. them I think it is, it is now that we should start to look within and look at ways to, to you know, to whatever values you think you have, mm. how to pass it to your child. Mm, right. You should try more than just sending them off and then blaming them later for decisions they make. Um, uh, we should spend more time around them and try to listen to them right. so that maybe when, maybe at the time she was trying to make that choice, if she had a close, sane adult, no, 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 you can't can just, just I'm me. just I, thinking. I this girl has not killed anybody. Ah. That is number one. Well, no? thank you. So I can't anybody. I can so leave her. Uh, her. Exactly. Her offense cannot. She, no, no policeman can charge her for falling in love. Her, her offense. Mm. So she's a uh, she's a victim. Don't cast her out. One, two. There are go, so, somebody just some people just killed a woman. Mm. Mm -hmm. We are not killing them. And nobody is talking. We are just talking about someone who was doing. There are two consenting adults. Mm. Yeah. Forget about whether they are in a religious house. They were not even in a religious yeah, no, house no, no, I'm just yeah. when they did it. So let's not, yeah, you're right, Waiki. So please, let us, when we, when we are judging, mm. let us know that whatever she did, yes. whatever they did, let us not, not, let's take it, 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 She cannot go to it's prison for it. Yes, it's not one. a crime. So it's don't go and castigate her so as she committed a crime. So your in Oshobo says, for crying out loud, she can't go out to the salon spa or even more because her face is everywhere. She should be surrounded by people because she can't. She can't. Nima, let's change that narrative. She can't. No, she said she should be surrounded by people because suicide is real. See, let me finish. People say Ajibade Isaac says, I still don't think the girl should be expelled. Mm. Talk about my phone now, my own, and okay. I can do anything with it. Yeah, why are we talking about the girl alone? She wasn't having sex with herself, one of the guy involved, which is why I wondered. Major Banks, whether adult or not, you signed to abide by back, back cop rules for whatever years mm -hmm. you spend in the school. So she signed it, and for the video or no, on no account must you do a video. It didn't happen are in you, school. An, are, are you an aspiring um, porno star, porn star? Then Tato Afroje says again, hypocrisy in Nigeria is too much. Mm. So let them start expelling students in Nigeria for having sex in yes, their private yeah. homes and hotels. Now even our relatives will not, even our relatives will not be spared. The whole mm -hmm. school will be yes, empty, yes, ranging now. from born again all uh, again mm -hmm. to Alaja. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, me, I, I, okay, so before we run off, I'm going to just beg everybody that all of you that have seen her face, don't go and see, don't be looking out for her anyway and now be talking. Um, yes, please, let's not do that because really. One more tweet. Okay, <laughs> please. One more tweet, please. <laughs> PJ Comedian says, just start. Just know that right now, if you are normal and sane, you cannot succeed in Lagos traffic. <laughs> Lagos traffic can make you look mad. <laughs> they to just your have kids to bring us back to the car with you. Let's I remember that there was, a, there was a big, big brother lady that also had that thing. The, uh, she's she married she now, she's happy. Us. So maybe, I mean, these things happen. Life happens to you. Just, just know that you didn't commit any crime. I'm talking to the girl lady right now. You killed somebody. You didn't yeah. kill anybody. You didn't commit a crime. You did something in private. Somebody this maliciously uh, um, uh, uh, shared it. And um, but at the same time, just keep your head up, and tomorrow will be a better day. Mm -hmm. Have a fabulous day. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.